Hi everyone, so in this video I will be discussing about TCS Digital Interview 24th May. Let's start. First of all, there was a TR plus MR interview which has started. The first question which they ask is the introduction. It is a very common question everyone will ask you. He directly jumped into the coding and he asked about first non-repeating character in a string. Okay, so first non-repeating character in a string, for example, there is a string uh, called um, I love India. Okay. Now, if you will see here, which will be the first non-repeating character which you are seeing, okay? So, if you will see here, so I is repeating in uh, here, okay? L, L is not repeating, O is not repeating, V is not repeating, E is not repeating. But the first non-repeating character in the whole string will be L, okay? So, we can find this, uh, L is the first non-repeating character, but how will we solve this question so this can be solved using map so we will just count the frequency and we can save uh, the characters in a ordered map okay ordered map so when we will use the ordered map it will ex uh, exactly use the characters in the correct uh, form okay so first it will store like i in the i it will uh, order uh, it will basically place i and then in the front of i it will place two because it is repeating two times then in the front of l it will repeat uh, put one because uh, l is repeating one time okay so we can create one ordered map and in the order map after creating the order map we can trace the keys and we will find out in which key the front value is one if the front value is 1, we can just return, return out that key. Okay. So that's how we can use the ordered map here. So we can use the ordered map and we can solve this question. Okay. Then uh, one more uh, thing which we can use is using double loops. We can use double loops. After using the double loops, we will start the tracing. We will just check if it is coming in the future string or not. Okay. So that's the another way which we can use. Then how to use for each loop? They asked about it. So for each loop is simple only. Uh, what is auto boxing and unboxing? So this is the concept of Java. Okay. Java. So this is they asked. What is SDLC? Okay. SDLC is basically software development lifecycle. This is they asked. Explain your project. We will move ahead with the interview. But uh, you will get the interview preparation notes link in the description. You can purchase the interview notes. You will be getting the ebook uh, here, which you, which will contain only the important questions. So you can use this ebook. Then we have OOPS, programming, STL collection framework, HR, DSA, project based questions, CS fundamentals, computer science, coding sheet, a lot of things here in the PDF itself. So you can use these notes as well. Okay. So you can use uh, these notes for your TCS interview preparation. So uh, uh, must try the notes. Okay. The price is only 199. You can use these notes in your future interviews as well. So it will make your preparation easy. Then uh, going ahead with it, uh, they asked what challenges you faced in the project, why only Java, how to connect SQL in Java. So this they asked, this is related to project only. Uh, what is JDBC? Okay, thanks. Then in the HR, they asked your future goal, why TCS, about the tech stack, some more questions related to joining and relocation. So in HR, if you can see here, the questions are very normal. In the TR, they ask the questions from projects here. All the projects are from uh, all the questions are for project only. Then in this, there is one coding question and some questions related to programming only. Okay, so this was the whole interview experience for TCS Digital. Uh, I think it is an easy medium interview, uh, not much difficult. Uh, we can easily solve it. Okay, thank you so much for watching this video.